We're all set to go to Mesa City! It had been a while since I'd been back in the U.S. Next up, the notorious mugshot. Ruthless muscle of the fiendish thigh. What he lacked in brains, he definitely made up for in brawn. Turns out he wasn't always that way. He grew up as the run of the litter. A neighborhood weakling. The only friends he could turn to were usually found on the big screen. It was there that he spotted his first gangster, and he knew instantly that that's what he wanted to be. He spent the rest of his youth working real hard to get there, fueled on his dreams of great power and respect. With enough perspiration, he realized that dream. He'd become a hard-boiled, street-brawling, tough-as-nails gangster, ensuring that he'd never be kicked on or pushed around again. So he's holed up in Mesa City, huh? I've always wanted to go to that thriving American boom town. Something's happened. Where is everyone? I don't know, but it's starting to give me the creeps. What do you say we take off? And miss all the fun? Besides, I want to try out that new move I got from Raleigh section of the Thievius Raccoonus. You mean the Ninja Spire Jump? Yeah. Do me a favor and read me the instructions again. To land safely upon diminutive points, leapeth lively and presseth the triggering device with the round geometrical object emblazoned upon it. So jump and hit the circle button to land on narrow spots. That's a rough translation. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
Lights. The latest in high-tech security. Electronic floor sensors. Step on them and you're a godder. Nice touch. They're safe to walk on while flashing, but it also means they're about to switch to a different sector. <laughs> and voila! Dial in 314.
This mugshot certainly isn't shy. Okay, so we know he's here somewhere, but how are we supposed to find him? Mesa City is a big place. Given that he's a bulldog, it seems only reasonable to assume that he chose to live in a giant fire hydrant. That's some sound logic, Sly. Now you just need to find a way to break into the building's base. Oh, I'm sure I'll think of something. for this key. Okay, so what do I do? Provide some covering fire for him with that blasting station. Sweet. Use the left analog stick to aim and press the square button to fire. I'll do my best. Let's go, Sly. <laughs> Job getting in, but look out for those guards. Mugshot's got those machine gun toting dogs hunting like a pack. <laughs>
going on down there? Well, I drove to this hot dog stand for a quick snack, and the next thing you know, I'm getting challenged to a race by these gangster dogs. Is there a key in it for the winner? Yeah, three times around the track for a key. It's all you, man. Drive the van with the left analog stick. And if you manage to pick up any nitro power-ups, you can get a boost by pressing the square button. Go get them. I'm on it. Look at that ugly mug. I am, and I find it infinitely fascinating. Huh? My X-ray detection devices reveal that a secret elevator to Mugshot's penthouse is contained within that giant head. So how do we get in? Behind this locked wall, there's a lever that summons the elevator. But you need all seven keys to open it up. I'm on it.
smash that thick glass, you'll need something super heavy, like that big wrecky ball up there. to figure this one out. Dial in four, six, eight.
could have broken this code in my sleep. The combination is 565. Five. Oh yeah, this will come in handy. It's Suzanne Cooper's notes pertaining to water safety. With this knowledge under your belt, you won't have to waste a charm whenever you fall into water. Look who just walked into my crosshairs, Sly Cooper. About time you showed up, Miss Fox. Was getting worried about you. Thought you took a wrong turn somewhere back in Paris. The only one making wrong turns is you, Sly. I'd suggest you surrender before I paralyze you with my good friend, the shock pistol. 
Now see, a girl whose best friend's a firearm's got issues. A little dinner, a little dancing, I think I can help you out. Hmm, sounds romantic, as long as you don't mind dining in jail. Nah, I hear the service is lousy. Once I catch you, you'll know for yourself. of himself to confuse guards into attacking the wrong thing. Use the triangle button to put together a fake Sly Cooper. have been yapping about some big mysterious dude running around cracking skulls and, <laughs> and 
And this is it? You're a monkey wrench in my operation? Some scrawny rat with a stick! Hey, wait a second. I seen that stick before. Maybe when my father knocked your block off with it. Your father? Wow! You're a Cooper? You know that Singus Rakamagookus had a lot of nice pictures, but way too many big boys. So you don't mind just handing it over? Why? <laughs> what are you kidding? You break into my place, steal my stuff, trash the joint, I feel transgressed and violated. Let's rock! A little pipsqueak like you, beating a big strong bruiser like me? It ain't right! You want all of that stupid picture book? You're gonna have to go down to Haiti and cross paths with Miss Ruby. And then believe you me, you don't want to be you! Mugshot section of the Thievius Raccoonus contain an entry from my gunslinging ancestor, Tennessee Kid Cooper. <laughs> His specialty was the rail walk and rail slide. Moves perfected through a lifetime of theft in the Old West. Getting out of town proved to be a little more challenging than getting in. Having just missed us, Inspector Fox went for the next best thing and dragged that canine steroid case off to jail. That was the end of Mugshot's gambling empire, and Mesa City's citizens soon returned home. While me and the boys, well, we enjoyed the rest of our stay in America and then returned to Paris, ready for our next mission. <laughs>